this evening I th thought we'd do a little conditioning exercise. Um, so we're going to do four rounds. Um, it's like a total body uh, workout. And so it's going to be four rounds. It'll last like 20 minutes in total. Um, and I'll just walk through what we're going to do each round. So here, and you're just going to step through over either your balls or the cones, whatever you have placed down. But you just want to have, okay, so I'll start like this. Go for a minute doing this. Burpees, lateral hop. Burpee, lateral hop. For one minute, okay? And you're just gonna alternate touching the ball or the cone on each side. So that's for a minute. So landing on both feet this time. 30 seconds of that, hands on the ground, feet out through the cones. I'm just gonna do the rowboat in and out of the cones or the balls. And that's for one minute and go. Try to coordinate your arms while you do this. Opposite arm, opposite knee. I'm just stepping over for right now. Just want to have a good tight core while you do this. Chest up if you can. Try not to look down at your feet the entire time. Thirty seconds down. Again, everything is at your own speed too. Okay. So when we get into the little bit more intense parts of the workout, everything's at your own speed. All right, we're gonna switch to step overs with high knees now. Okay, so same thing, but now you're going a little bit faster. You're bouncing up off the ground, getting those knees up, stabilizing on one leg. Again, everything is at your own speed today. Remember, this is the first round of four. Really try to get those knees up, keep your chest up, keep your core braced. 30 seconds down. Quick feet through, stabilize, quick feet. Don't rush through it, do it with good form. Get those knees up when you do it. Okay, and hold. Next one is uh, the burpee, lateral hop burpee. So burpee, lateral hop. Try to hop over the ball, or at least behind it, with a lateral hop after every burpee. 20 seconds left. Woo. Doing a burpee after every hop. All right, and hold, next one, front plank. So you're gonna get into the front plank position. Just alternate with your hands, touching the ball.
Try to have your hands underneath your shoulders. Keep your body in that clean plank position. 25 seconds left. Remember, this is round one. It's a hell of a workout. Keep your shoulders and your hips square to the ground the whole time. All right, next one, squat, jump, lateral hops. Okay, so for 30 seconds, just two-footed hops over the balls. This is only for 30 seconds. Get both the feet over the ball. Try to get a little squat. On each jump as well. All right, and hold. Next one is the ab rows. Okay, so on the ground from this position, just gonna row in and out. Move to the next opening after every row. Extend those legs, shift your body, put your hands on the ground, right, to help you turn your body. Woo. Again, everything's at your own speed today. 25 left. Pull this tough one. Try to keep going. Feel like me, you're feeling your legs already. <laughs> and hold. Ready. Go. Maintain good form. Right? You don't have to go as fast through this one. You're just maintaining good form. Keep that chest up. Keep that core nice and tight. Sink your arms. This will help you out later. Help with your balance as well. This is round two of four. Just stepping over. Getting the footwork down. Going 15 left. We'll burn a lot of calories to this workout. Okay. Step overs with high knees now. Step overs with high knees. So now we're bouncing through it a little bit quicker. Quick feet through the middle. Stabilize on the end. Again, sink your arm movement. Opposite elbow, opposite knee. Get those knees up when you go through. Round two of four. 25 seconds left. Battle through the pain. Go at your own speed. All right, next one, burpees. Burpees with the lateral hop. One minute. Woo. You can add the push up in if you want. Don't have to go all the way down though. Just do a straight up burpee. 
just backing it up. You don't have to go all the way down. You do want to add that push up in for a little extra challenge. I might add one to the middle every time. Burpee after every lateral hop. All right, into the high plank with the ball taps or to your cones, whatever. So high plank. Try to keep your hips and your shoulders square to the ground the entire time. Always in as moving as your arms. Whew. 30 seconds left. Round two or four. You need to modify it, that's fine. Right, modify it just by putting your knees on the ground, that's okay. Again, everything's at your own speed. Pushing yourself. 10 left, 10 seconds left. All right, next one, 30 seconds, squat hops. So two footed lateral hops with a little squat in the beginning. 30 seconds, round two or four, two footed hops. Keep that chest up when you hop. Try to clear over the ball or the cone if you can. All right, and hold. Next one, ab rows. So again, you're gonna sit down. We're gonna do one minute of ab rows. Ready to go. Round two or four. Again, go as fast as you can. Go at your own pace. You need to take a little break and then get going again, that's fine. You're working with what you got right now, trying to make yourself better. 30 seconds down. Keep going. 20 seconds left. Ooh, these are hard to finish with. All right, round two is done. Back to the step overs. Okay, round three, stepping over. Back to the single leg step overs. One minute, round three or four, good job. More than halfway done. My basement's gonna be covered in sweat after this. Just stepping over. Twenty seconds left. Maintain good form. Little chance to catch your breath here. Sink up your arms. Ooh. All right, into the high knee step overs now. Now we're picking up the pace. Put those knees up. Keep moving those knees up. Quick through the middle. Stabilize on the outside. Keep that good form. 30 seconds now. Round three to four. Whew. 
Quick feet through. Quick feet through. Ten seconds left. High knees. Pick those knees up. Pick those knees up. Okay, into the burpees. Right? Yeah, burpees. Burpees, lateral hop. Again, go at your own speed. Try to do it as quick as you can. But maintain good form. Ball starting a little bit. Thirty seconds left. Round three or four. Five seconds, do one more. Okay, high plank. High plank uh, ball taps. Maintain your form here. Switch to modified if you need to, that's fine. Do it for a couple seconds here. Right, doing a modified. Totally fine. Keep that core braced as you do it. 30 seconds. Keep up the work. Go at your own speed. Keep that core nice and tight though. Seven seconds left. Don't have to go fast touching the ball. Just maintain good form. All right, 30 second squat hops. 30 second lateral squat hops. Here we go. Two foot hops over the ball. This is a proper workout. All right, that's 30 seconds. Back down into the ab rows. One minute of the ab rows, ready to go. Right into it. Go at your own speed. It's okay to take breaks if you need to. Just try to push yourself. Really try to push yourself. Trying to do 10 good ones in a row, then take a little break. Do this in my legs. Five seconds left. All right, we're on the last round here. Last round. Step overs. Here we go. Round four of four. Come on, stay strong. This is where mentally you need to help your body out a little bit. Maintain good form. Push yourself through those walls. Find that extra bit of energy for this last round. You got it inside of you. Just need to find it. Hopefully mine's there as well. <laughs> Fourth round, always the hardest. 
Last quarter of the match is always the hardest to push your body through. It's always the difference though. Okay. Step over high knees, quick feet now, high knees. Here we go. Can you get your feet through there quickly? Keeping your knees high, stabilizing on the end. Can you do it with clean form? Meaning, is your chest up? Are your knees coming up? Are your hands in sync with your legs? Is your core tight? Don't throw your body over the balls. Control your body over them. Everything on the balls of your feet, stabilize. Strong ankles, strong knees, strong hips. Fifteen seconds left. Last round here, come on. Got ten seconds to go. Max speed. Good. And into the burpees. Burpee, lateral hop. Last round, come on. What do you got inside you? Only person you're competing with is yourself. And maybe some other people that you can see on the screen. <laughs> maybe compete against me. Less than 30 left, come on. Keep pushing yourself. Late stages of the game, get knocked down, have to recover. See a breakaway to score the winning goal. Push yourself. All right, minute of the planks. One minute of the plank, front plank. Keep your core nice and strong. Don't forget to breathe. What kind of limits can you push your body through? What kind of energy can you find stored in your body? Look through your legs, look through your hands, look through your arms, but find those molecules of energy and bring them to the surface. They're there somewhere. 10 seconds left, come on, you can do it. Yeah, nice shot. 30 seconds now, squat, hops. Again, keep good form, get a little squat, two feet, 30 seconds, 10 seconds down already. One more. All right, final exercise. We got the ab rows. Here we go, one minute, go ahead. Get those rows in. Bend, don't break. Bend, don't break. Keep going. Oh, I can feel it in my legs. Push yourself through. Stay strong. Keep rolling. Keep rolling. Get as many as you can in. Get a few more in. 
Yeah, that's fine. Woo! Ah, good stuff. Just juggling here now for five minutes. It's good to work out together for sure. And hopefully yeah. you guys are staying in touch with each other. Uh, um, <clears throat> you know, keep pushing yourselves to work out when you got a chance. Uh, you know, help each other out. Uh, in terms of getting school work done and that kind of stuff. And, uh, you know, it, it's hard, all this isolation. It's, uh, I know for me, it's like day to day. Uh, like some days I wake up and I'm like depressed and some days I feel good, like, like normal, but it's just, you know, it's a, it's a roller coaster of emotion. So, um, you know, make sure you're reaching out to each other and, you know, just the difference of texting somebody and saying, Hey, what's up? How's it going today? Or, you know, or like, let's, let's link up for a virtual workout later today, something like that. Um, Cause you never know what somebody's going through. And sometimes a little pick me up is means a big deal to somebody. You know